Pixonic. I, I, I'm a clan owner, and I'm having some issues, and I'm, I'm hoping that you're going to help me with this, because I'm trying to help you with this. I, I've been all over the fan page last month talking about the connection issues. Now you have people ha also having the connection issues. Now, is it because I have foresight or I see this coming or what it is, couldn't tell you. But I don't like to be the one to say I told you so. I'd like to be the one to say I'd like to help you with your problems. So let me first note the problem, okay? I've got missing members, members that were very important to me as a clan owner because I've been in, I have invested my time, effort, and energy into training and, and teaching these people on how to squad, how, how the game works, and how to improve their own game. Now... I am a little bit of an expert, but I am not the top tier. You know, I'm still learning the game myself. And who's not? It's a constantly evolving game. But here's my issue. I've got people who have been inactive since the update. Why that is, I'm not 100% sure. But I've got a lot of negative numbers which are affecting my clan rating. We were almost going to be going for the... Uh, challenge for the clan and now I've got multiple here's one uh, negative 191 you know and, and, and I'm doing what I can I've got a positive 171 so that balances that out I've been busting my butt trying to keep our uh, head above water um, operators on cool I I've been worried about him. Um, Mizzle. He's an officer, as you can see. Has not done anything since the update. Neither has Neg's Magazine. Now, I'm going to address him in just a minute. Because you'll see. Start down at the bottom. And I'm just going to count these guys out. Other than uh, Neg's Mazing and uh, Mizzle, I also had uh, one other person, Hawk E, 3E. He is also inactive. He's got an 8. He, he, he started his qualification process, but didn't get very far. One, maybe two rounds, and... That's up, what, five or six that's required? So we're going to count the zeros. I got Siege Hunter, who was a good squatter. Uh, Callie, also a squatter. That's two. Killer is three. Nihilate, he, he was a squatter. He's a young kid. Uh, Calibri Cracker, that's nine. Ten is I'm not saying that. Griffin is eleven. Twelve is meta. Did I count that right? Hold on, I'll start it from the beginning. I have my officers, which are two, and I have Hawk. The rest I'm counting is zeros. So three is Hawk and Siege is four. I'll take this back down to the bottom. Siege is once again four. Get this plugged in so I don't lose power while I'm trying to record. All right. Siege is number four. Cali is five. Killer is six. Nihilate is seven. Uh, Cal Beam Cracker is eight. Bolts of Lock is nine. Ten. 11, 12, 12, well, 11, because Mizzle I just counted twice. 11 members of my, my clan are MIA. And as you can see, I can hold up to...
38 members. So 11 are MIA. And I have got a lot of negative numbers that have, have been staying negative. So these are people that are not playing at the current. I, I've been trying to keep my eye on it. You know, I'm actually quite satisfied to see five people online. I've been trying to build squads since January when y'all had mentioned that y'all were going to offer special events for squads. So I built two clans and started recruiting and, and building squads and teaching these people how to do this. So I would have an opportunity to win some of these special, unique prizes. You know, I, I, I am a huge supporter of this game. Okay? You could ask... Anybody who knows me, I'm all about this game. I don't even need the support. You can you can check your fan page. You, you, you can ask Max. I'm a huge supporter of this game. But now I've got to figure out how to recover my lost players. And my lost investment of time, effort, and energy. You know, you could easily see that... I've got some stuff invested here. Oh man. You know? If I rephrase my thing, then it's going to wipe out all the donations. I, I, I've been kind of like busy okay, I'm rebuilding my account. You know, I had to build that raven for the Halloween event. I finished building it after, but. I got it halfway built during the Thomas and Johnny event because I needed it for one doohickey. I ended up getting it done in skirmish on almost the last days. And it was a grind to get that finished. Now I'm busting my butt trying to help you all with this game. And, and I'm not getting anything but grief and hell for it. You know? Granted... You know, I, I've been winning contests, but now I've also given up my free-to-play status so I could have some nice things because y'all shut those drones off for the free-to-play players. There's only one way to get a decent drone, and that's to open your wallet. You're making a major division. At least it, before I could open up one of these events and work really, really hard and possibly earn myself a way into a drone. You know, yes, it, it would be nice if I could sit there and say, yeah, I want the drone box. Or I want to go after the, you know, this kind of weapon. It, it would be nice if I had a little bit more chance at earning what I would like to earn. Because I wanted to earn a Demir. I, I, I ended up earning to the paint. But I knew if I could have continued down looking for this, I wasn't going to get even to the pilot. Much less the actual Demeter. I might have lucked out and earned the parts along the way. But... There was no real goal, even if I dedicated myself every day solely onto this one account. You know, I got, so far, one weapon. Two pilots. The paint. And parts. Components. Why is power cells in here? I don't have a use for Joanna. It would be nice. I'd like to use. I I, I wish I could trade her for Ghost. 
you know, at the moment, right now I got an Orochi, I, I can't get the ghost. I was busy chasing after other things. I knew how important drones are to the game. I've got a decent drone collection for a form of free to play. I've only bought two things. One was the drone operation for that paralysis drone. And the other I just picked up was the Demeter. Can you understand why I even bothered to pick up the Demeter? First off, it was special edition. Second, I already had the pilot for it. So I'm invested heavily into this game and into the future of this game. Starting tomorrow, I'm, I'm actually getting back onto the test server. I haven't got onto the test server since before the drone work, rework. I found out that, yeah, I, I, I had been missing out on the bonus because I thought I was wasting my time doing the test server for for shits and giggles, just having fun with it. I, can, I, I wasn't gaining, at least on my account, I was able to gain or regain my placement. I, I have to rebuild this whole account to a level where I can be back into the masters and champs. All because of the the resets and rebalances and then all these funky tasks. I have to switch all this over to an Icarus line. You know, it would be nice if I switched it out to the Icarus line and then could reset my league level and go down to the lower league and then play on an equal footing. But honestly, I, I, I get up into the Masters, y'all give me that funky Icarus task or whatever... Then I'm dropping all the way down to the Silver League, trying to do kills with an Icarus. Because uh, I'll put the whole lineup as Icarus. Or maybe I need my heals or something of that nature. I better leave that plugged in. Now, as you can see, I, I'm, I'm, I'm very, very passionate about this game. And there are a lot of things I would like to see changed and brought to it. One is which is the scorecard. Now, if there were a few items added to the scorecard, I think it would add a little bit more competition amongst the players, as well as a little bit more pride. Now, if I had right here on my current level, the highest level I have ever achieved, that way it would be like a high watermark. I could always push up. Like, maybe I had become a master or a champion. I would have that as a bragging right. Maybe you can even put a date on there. Last held master at, you know. That's just like having this high damage right here. Max damage dealt. Now, you got these high water marks. This 14 win streak, I'm pretty sure, was handled at the very beginning of the game. On my first run through. On this account. This may have been my seventh or eighth time I installed the game. And I finally still learned how to keep the account. I saved it. I, I, I created a Google account at that point seven years ago so I've been playing a long long time I know this game very well I teach people how to play they doubt my skills all the time and I'm okay with that it doesn't bother me I'm not here to prove anything you can see I got 6,000 victories that right there is proof that I kind of know what I'm doing but if we had a high water mark for the leagues, then you might not have as many tankers. Okay, with the event coming to a close, you got a lot of people shooting to be in Silver League so they can have a quick come up when the next event starts.
when I just built the other account for my other clan, I was seeing tankers in the private league. Now, why I'm seeing hell burners with last stands dropping minoses in private league is beyond me. And I couldn't look up their account because the platforms aren't completely correct. Now, how do you report somebody if you can't look at their account? That's backwards. Your report button, eh, it's overcomplicated. You need to have it as a simple flag. Hey, review this match. Have a little note after. Hey, this is why the match needs to review. This way, at least, if the person is incorrect on why the match is being reviewed, it will at least get reviewed. There's a lot of backwards things going. If on this scorecard, you had a fastest match. If right over here, you have a preferred game style. Maybe I'm like Islander and like free-for-all. Maybe I'm like Adrian and I, I'm Beacon Rush and Dom. Maybe I'm pulling a Manny where I'm a little all over the board and I even like the TDM. You know? Have on here the highest beacons captured in a game. You need to hook up some of the beacon guys a little bit better. Because as my Loki, I was getting 10, 15 beacons in one game. And I'm still the lowest man on the totem pole. Because I had to stay in cloak and run and run and run. Well, everybody else is not chasing after the beacons and only going for damage. Losing the game, but getting the, the higher kudos. The higher place on the scorecard. And even though I was busting my butt and doing my work, now, you see what my account looks like. I'm going for damage. Quick damage. I'm running in and I'm closing out a game in two minutes, three minutes flat. Chasing these people back into their spawn, not even giving them a chance to breathe. I can show you to you eight days a week. And only when my game doesn't load in 15 seconds until after it starts. That's when I have problems. Probably because somebody backed out. But... You're not penalizing those players that will jump in. You know, you don't... And jump out, leaving a whole squad of people hanging and needing help. You know, you're not giving that squad a buff so they actually have an equal chance. And that's all I'm saying. Right now you got... You've got, uh, right now, you've got the arena. This is basically gambling, but it's not. Because it's supposed to be a free-for-all type event, yet you got people time-dropping, having a teammate. So if you have two people working together... It makes it where a solo player has no option but to take third place or lower. And that's if they're the best. How do I have an option for any of these prizes? You know, I, I, I won one and that was in third place. I can't afford it. Look, I've got 500. That's because I just won 400 gold. How do I have an option for that boombox devastator? 
And, and why do I chase one boombox devastator? There ain't no point to it. During Adrian's show today, somebody was like, Ooh, I wonder what we get for 100 wins. I'm like, yeah, great. I can tell you're cheating. I had the same issue with the, on the fan page just the other day. I'm like, dude, teaming up with somebody, coordinating, is that that's breaking the whole ideology of the game. You're not looking out for the players, and I'm upset. We're losing players. It's costing me all my effort and all my work and all my time that I've put in and my dedication. Can you hear the frustration in my voice? I don't like raising my voice, and I, I really have been earnestly asking to help. I wanted to work with you. I wanted a job. Hell, I would have even worked for game credit and, and worked for little prizes. You know, it's bad enough I'm, I'm, I'm sharing Adrian's stream, every stream. Even, like, today, he didn't have a giveaway going. He was short on likes from his goal. That's dedication. I, did, have I gotten a hookup from Adrian? No, I've won the contest. And in fact, now he's changing the rules. So I'm not going to be able to win as often as I have. And I'm okay with that. Does it hurt me a little bit? Because I want to keep winning. I like having nice stuff. And I know that I'm getting get shut off of it. Because I've already won so many different of the, the giveaways. So now he's making hidden rules. Is that my fault? Probably so. Because I have been so fortunate. And I do follow the rules. And I do try to help. Should I be punished for that? Probably not. Maybe Pixonic should say, hey, you know, he didn't give away the secrets that would break the game. I could have easily said, hey, look, if y'all do this, this, and this, you don't have to play the game right, but, yeah, you're cheating in a way, but it makes the game really easy on you, but I'm the Boy Scout, okay, I work extra hard so others can learn, and I don't have to teach how to cheat the game. To excel in it. I have pride, morals, ambition. You know, I'm, I'm telling my, uh, my clan member in here, hey, look, they're allowing it to happen. He's asking, hey, do you recommend participating in the arena? I'm like, I saw uh, it's much cheaper, but it's a gamble. You know, this would be a good time to squad. If you were going to get on comms, I could see us time dropping. Then we could have a decent chance of winning the arena since Pixonic is allowing it to happen. I've sent you pictures of what happened when I won that match. You don't see me trying to squad with him on comms so I can take advantage of the arena. I'm trying to bring forth these issues and problems. I've just spent a good half hour talking to this tablet when I should be getting my game ahead. I've got plenty of these chores to do. I'm already losing some of my chores. No, no. On my other account, I have lost chores. I'm, I'm asking this game right here, the Warpath, how do I complete this? Nobody even knows how to even complete it. See? I'm, oh, that I understand. 
but is that the commander or is that the the base fortification because i might be able to finish the commander like really really quick but i'm very frustrated i'm very dedicated to this game and i'm hoping that i'm being heard i really am this is breaking my heart we're losing players we are losing. We. You can hear me say we when I'm talking to Pixonic. Max, I've asked several times, consider me for a job. You know, I, I back in... Come on, man. You already know who I am. I bugged the hell out of you because I didn't know if this game was made for kids. Establishing my YouTube for the very first time. Thinking I was on a deadline. Not for the 400 gold for participating in the test server. I thought that being in the test server was my audition for working with Pixonic. And I thought it was a thank you for reaching top fan status. Because I did dedicate. Yeah, I'm also very annoying. I know that. But if I'm given... A directive if I'm given a goal I seek out and I achieve my goals I'm gonna be sending this into you and I, I really hope this is gonna reach the right desks this game is hurting I'd like to help please consider it I wish you all a good night, good morning, good afternoon, whatever it is in your neck of the woods, as my brother Tony says. <sighs> Look at Kitty. Not bad. Look at most of the tubers. They've all slowed down. They're switching out games. Look at Ghost. He does, He deleted all his game, uh, his robots, and he, he plays a different game altogether now. You know, you're losing your content creators. You're losing your players. It's time to wake up. Playing customer retention is not wise. Max, give me a chance. You once said, probably in jest or, or to be coy, you know, it, it, you would, let's see how you would do if you were running your own tech company. Give me an opportunity. I've got a lot of love for this game and I want to see it succeed. I'm not here to put you down or any of the actions that you've done. I know you have had the same desires. Mm. And the same intent. Okay, so we should, oh, man, no. Let me work with you. Let me help. I've got some ideas. I've got some thoughts. And I want to see this game grow. Okay. Uh, before I go, I did want to make note on that one returning clan member I have next he hasn't played in in since before the update Locked. now his account has been completely revamped he just returned a month two months ago or so and prior to his return he had never seen a Titan he had never seen a pilot and he had never seen a drone. All this has been purchased. And he's been working his way to get out of what he used to have. I just went and asked him exactly how much he invested. 
but after I, I telling him, hey, check out this wasp they put out today. Dang. What's he say? He's done spending money on that game. On that game. On that game. He's done. He spent a lot with you. He, he invested to say thank you to Adrian just because I brought him in to say hey. Say thank you, Adrian. He's cool. You know, you know, get go go ahead and become a member of his thing and, and get on his Discord. That I saw as a good investment. I see this game as a good investment. Let's let's not make me wrong here. I would like to be right on this issue. I said the drone rework was a mistake. I stand by that. I said we were having issues with connection. I stand by that. I got put in and out of LPQ four different times. And I lost the last end of the event, of the last event. And I lost the beginning part of this event. Because of being put in LPQ. And not all of that, I think, was on me. I think some things were done and I need some hookup. Reconciliation, you know. I believe that's the correct word, but I feel owed is what I'm saying. And I'm even opening my wallet and investing into the game now. You see my Demeter being upgraded. Demeter I just bought with cash. Okay. So I'm investing cash. I've given up my free-to-play PlayStation just for the love of this game. I have given up jobs for the love of this game. So for the love of my sanity, come on now. I didn't want to become into the Creators Club. I didn't want to give up secrets and tricks. Because as a free-to-play player, if I was going to give up secrets and tricks, then the paid players would also have those available to them. And then I would not have the slight little advantage I had. That is coming to an end. I apparently need to come up to with my 500 subscribers. I hope this helps.